What's up, everyone, and welcome back to Movie Raise. Bridgerton Season 2 is only a few months away, but fans have already been losing their minds to find out more about the new season. Details have been pretty scarce lately, but we already know a lot of information about the new season and what it may mean for the Bridgertons. Season 1 set the tone for what is bound to be one of the best Netflix original series so far, and I think I speak for all of us when I say, surely the best is yet to come for this incredible new series. Before we really take a look into all of the details of Season 2, make sure you hit that like button and ring the notification bell for more great videos. I'm sure we were all well aware of what the first season of Bridgerton looked like. Daphne and the Duke of Hastings hit it off very early in the season and after they got married. The real fun began. These two were hooking up at every opportunity they had, just like any newlywed couple. On the stairs, in the hall, in the bathroom, literally everywhere. As hot and heavy as season one may have been, I'm sure season two will be even hot and heavier. The first season told the story of young Daphne and her search for love in a town that seemed to want to tear her family apart at every turn. She did her best to save herself for the right man, and it seems as though she made a wonderful decision when she eventually found interest in a handsome duke that came riding into town on horseback. Me. Forgive me. Your name, sir. Am I honestly to believe you do not already know my name? Needless to say, their relationship was rocky at best. The two started a courtship simply to please Daphne's family, more specifically, her mother. However, one thing led to another, and the two eventually got involved in a legitimate relationship. However, after the Duke learned that Daphne's innocence ran deep within her, he began to back away and refused to even speak to her. He did his best to break off the relationship because he didn't want to be the one to break her innocence. But fate had different plans. Daphne refused to let go of their newfound love and convinced the Duke to marry her. However, not before her brother nearly shot the man dead in a field. There will be no need to resume. The Duke and I are to be married. Though, after they were married, their relationship was deeply troubled. Daphne would soon learn that the Duke had made a commitment to his father that he would never have children. She found this out after the Duke had repeatedly been acting strangely and refused to fully consummate their marriage. After many episodes of utter turmoil, Daphne broke down in front of the Duke and it seems as though he finally had a change of heart. At the end of it all, Daphne and Duke learned that they were expecting a child. Just as the season wound down to an end, Daphne gave birth, setting the tone for season two. While it would be amazing to continue the story of Daphne and the Duke, season two will see these two take a back seat from the spotlight. The story of season two will mostly focus on Anthony and his quest for love after finding nothing but heartbreak with his former lover. We don't know what all this may entail, but if the book is anything to go by, things will be just as steamy in season two as they were in season one, but with a bit of a twist, since the story may largely be told from a man's perspective. But let's be real, with how handsome and charming Anthony is, I don't think it would be too difficult for him to find the right match. All of this leads us to the impending release of season 2 of Bridgerton. But when can we expect the show to be released? Well, it wasn't renewed for a second season until January of 2021. The official Twitter account for the series announced this news on January 21st in a letter from Lady Whistledown that read, Dearest readers, the ton are abuzz with the latest gossip, and so it is my honor to impart to you, Bridgerton shall officially return for a second season. I do hope you have stored a bottle of Ratafia for its most delightful occasion. This incomparable cast of Bridgerton will return to production in the spring of 2021. This author has been reliably informed that Lord Anthony Bridgerton intends to dominate the social season. I will have my pen ready to report on any and all of his romantic activities. However, gentle reader, before you set the comment section alight with requests for more sordid details, know that I am disinclined to report on the particulars at this time. Patience, after all, is a virtue. Yours truly, Lady Whistledon. We haven't heard too much else from the series, except that Simone Ashley has been hired on as Anthony's main love interest. We don't know much about her character or what this may mean for the show, but it's great to see a bit of diversity being added to the cast, now that Rage Jean Page will be leaving the series. Yes, that's right. Everyone's heartthrob from season one will not be coming back for season two. 
This news broke earlier this year when Reggie said that returning for season two just didn't make sense for him. It seems as though the writers had already incorporated him into the script for the new season, but he backed out at the final moments due to some issues with the contract. There is no bad blood between Reggie and the crew, though. He fully understands that it's just business. Reggie posted to social media and said, It's been the ride of a lifetime. It's been an absolute pleasure and a privilege to be your Duke. Joining this family, not just on screen, but off screen too. Our incredibly creative and generous cast, crew, outstanding fans, it's all been beyond anything I could have imagined. The love is real and we'll just keep growing. We don't know all the juicy details about why he will not be coming back for season 2, but it seems as though this was all a part of Reggie Jean Page's plan. He said that from the very beginning, he knew he'd only be appearing for one season. He is certainly open to coming back and making cameo appearances in the future, but he has no plans of being in season 2. He seems to have his hopes set high as he continues on with his career in search of bigger, better roles, and we definitely hope the best for him in the future. The show will certainly not be the same without him, but let's be real, the show isn't going to be the same regardless. When you are alone, you can touch yourself in a way that gives you pleasure, but especially between your legs. It seems like the writers are taking a lot of influence from the shows like Skins, in which the lead cast members change each and every season. This isn't a bad thing, though. Everyone loves Anthony and the intense energy he brings to the series. His love life was already teased quite a bit in the first season, and I'm personally stoked to see more of him and have him take the spotlight for a while. As of May 2021, we know that filming has begun for the second season. A series of paparazzi photos was released by People Magazine that shows the cast in full costume, gearing up for a few scenes. The cast all look positively fantastic, and the clothing choices this time around are stunning. Photos of Daphne from season 2 emerged as well. She looks much older this time around, but she is still sporting her petite and conservative dresses, as well as her signature white gloves. One of the most interesting aspects of the show is that the Bridgerton's father will make a few appearances, like in the form of flashbacks. We all know that he passed away after getting stung by a bee when the children were very young, but it seems like Anthony had more than enough time to get to know his father before he passed away. I'm sure he will spend a lot of time talking about him as he follows his example and finds a suitable mate to settle down with in the new season. Thanks for watching! Be sure to hit the like button and ring the notification bell for more videos!